quite flip the, mo the momentum we tried with Quay, tried to get the crowd all fired up over there on about five on, on in, and uh, he made a really nice birdie on five and uh, just couldn't quite you know, flip the script. Um, but our guys are always going to fight and hang in there. And uh, uh, again, it was, it, was a, it was a really good day. I hate that we lost, uh, but great, great learning experience for our guys. Sounds like you like the way you play, or you like the way you competed. How'd you play? Did, did, did your guys bring their games, you know, to this uh, last day? Yeah, I'm, I, again, I wasn't around everybody all the time, but from what I saw, I'm going to say that, yeah, we had some guys struggling early on. Very similar to what we've done the last couple of days, to be honest. Uh, you know, this golf course makes you struggle a little bit. I mean, it's it's tough. You hit in the weeds a couple of times, and all of a sudden your confidence uh, kind of goes out the window a little bit. So, uh, you know, I mean, I see a guy right now on TV, he's over dropping out of the weeds. I mean, it's just kind of what the golf course does to you. And uh, Auburn was just better than us today. I guess you had to feel pretty good about the future going forward, too, kind of like I mentioned. It, yeah, I mean, you know, hey, it, it, it's such a long season. I hadn't even really thought about what, what <laughs> you know, right now we, we just got done and, and uh, we, we love where we're at with our young guys and uh, excited about the future of our golf program for sure just because that's what we uh, put stock into. And, uh, but it, like I said at the beginning, it, it, it's hard for me uh, thinking about a guy like Grant Hurst, but no different than a guy like Max McGreevy last year. You know, when you lose those guys, uh, it just, you know, puts a little hole in your heart and, and uh, you know, we'll miss him. Talk a little bit more about Grant. What has he meant to this program over the years? Uh, consistency. He's, he's been one, one of the most consistent guys I've ever uh, been a part of in college golf. And, uh, you know, he's not the guy that's going to go out and shoot 65, but he's rarely the guy that goes out and shoots a 75. You know, he just – he's anywhere from a, a 69 to a 74 pretty much his whole career. Very dependable, you know, and, and uh, us as coaches, we love dependability. So uh, he's, he's been great. But it, it's not even about the golf. He's um, such just a fun guy to be around. He's sneaky funny. Uh, and, you know, he's, he's about a 3-4 student as well in the business school. So you kind of add up all three of those areas, and you've got a pretty, pretty great guy. Coach, sorry to be a little late to the party here, but obviously it's tough.